guys. Oh my goodness. Um, this is our buddy cam. Listen, let me just give you guys a PSA, a heat advisory. Because as I walk into the grocery store, one of the um, one of the staff is, is falling out, I guess, out of the heat. So please protect yourself. Be careful today. Uh, for those of you that are coming on, hey Periscope, this is gonna be your first time shopping with us. I feel so bad. I just walked past the young lady. Um, obviously suffering with the heat. I was standing out there in the parking lot myself trying to get my cameras together. I'm like, let me get inside and figure this out. Um, so thanks guys for jumping on. Hey lady. Hey, how what are you got? Look, we got we got two broadcasts with us today. <laughs> What you awesome. making today? Oh, you making a dessert? I need a dessert. Yes, fresh berry tart. Fresh also, to go with a maybe Caesar style tortellini with pork. And we just said we didn't know what to cook, but I really wanted a salad. Oh, awesome. And so that's see, that's why that's why I come to Publix. Yes. I, is the salad is that hot or cold? It's I think warm. You're cooking the because you got a pasta, pasta with that, mm -hmm. and the pork's gonna be. Alright guys, so right over here where you get to do your sampling, you know, y'all just grab a sample and go, but these are some of the best meals ever. Oh, and uh, we, we made the Italian pie. Uh, oh, look at the beef with mushroom gravy. So the good part about it is when they have the recipe cards up here, you yes. grab the recipe, you just walk around here to the side, and all your ingredients are right here now. When I went into the caregiver space, you already know this was a lifesaver for me because I got a chance to get my life back, some time back. Um, but basically what you would do is you would just simply get one of each ingredient and there you go. What's, okay, whipped, Philadelphia whipped, they got whipped. And then I just kind of look at the prices and look at the budget, but one of the things about it, the way we took this to the next level, is we looked at some of the shortcuts that the recipes recipes give us great shortcuts and so we looked at some of the recipes and then we learned how to dial back some of that convenience say for instance convenience being the can or the items that were in the can the items that were in the jar and then um and like things like this like we go for a fresh um thing because you know my cooking coach was like okay let me show you how to make that but look okay so no, I thought we bought some yogurt but she this has a dessert Caesar style tortellini with pork all right now y'all know I do love pork I do love a good pork can y'all see that on Facebook hey glitter I haven't even invited anybody in because I was taking it back because um somebody was having some heat issues so let me invite a couple of people on so I usually stop here just to kind of get a couple of ideas I really wanted a salad but I wanted some salmon, so I'm going to think about the pork. Looks like that pork may take a little bit of, a little bit more cooking preparation than I want to devote to today. I'm already like lazily moving through the day. Periscope is on with us too, guys, and Periscope. So we're doing a dual broadcast. Why are we doing a dual broadcast? Because, 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 because public always has Wi-Fi. Now another thing. Um, dialing back the convenience is going from the frozen to fresh so I'm looking at the fact that they and I was I was really thinking about doing salmon with a vegetable blend in the um, the foil bake but you know y'all I'm like really wanting to if, if I think think about the budget this is going to serve it served oh whoa this serves six we, we're no longer a household for six okay i'm no longer a household i'm trying to get that in both of the shots and i can't but i am no longer a household of six so i'm, I'm trying to figure out if i can cut back on any of this um but again you just basically grab one and if i wanted to do some quick shopping because i want you guys to like shop a couple times a week instead of just stocking your freezer I would grab one each item and then boom, I would have everything on this list. And it's um, called it for the pork tenderloin. It's got one large tomato, a Caesar salad kit, which I don't see. Oh, there it is, Caesar salad kit. Um, fresh berries, which are up there. You guys see that, the fresh berries are up there. Cheese tortellini, which they have right here in your convenience pack. 
uh, whipped cream cheese, so you don't have to whip your own cream cheese. Well, you can whip your own cream cheese, but hey, listen, if you don't have time, they got it whipped already. Um, some Greek yogurt, so it's got the yogurt right there. And then, um, remember, I was just talking about Patty Betty the other day about some yogurt. Um, because apparently, you can take Greek yogurt and flour and make biscuits. That's a two ingredient biscuit. Take the Greek yogurt. Fold in some flour, bake it, and apparently you get a really good biscuit. I like a good buttermilk biscuit. That's the next best thing. I mean, maybe we should get the Greek yogurt and play and, and play with it. Yeah, play with it <laughs> and try that. Um, I'm what two for seven dollars? Oh, that's with the budget, baby. All right, let's see. Uh, sliced black olives. I don't too much care for the olives on anything. Let's see, Parmesan cheese. I would switch right around here and get that fresh. A near fresh Parmesan cheese for a better flavor, and then of course it's calling for some uh, the shortbread pie crust. Let me see how they did that. Look at that! Who knew we had shortbread? I won't get one of these just for the heck of a shortbread pie crust. I'm really thinking about the dessert because I really want some dessert and the berries too. On a, it's, and it's a hot day. You really want a nice salad on a hot day. This is actually going to give us a little bit of a warm salad because you're going to have the salad with putting that on there. I'm, I'm thinking about going for this because it's hot, y'all. It's so hot and who can think? Only thing is I'm not going to do the pork because I'm not doing the serving for six. Let me see how, let's see how they are cooking the pork. I'm going to see how they're cooking the pork. If, if it's a setting and forget it, I might go with it. Okay, so the pie crust. Then from your pantry, honey. We just bought honey, so we don't need that. Dijon mustard. I don't know if I have Dijon mustard or not. Canola, canola oil. Uh, I think I might even need some more oil. Uh, powdered sugar. Powdered sugar. I guess that's powdered sugar up there for, well, yep, a dollar nine. That's definitely within budget. And then, of course, kosher salt. And we definitely already have our kosher salt. So, and the tea, my mother. Y'all don't know, I know how many gallons of tea I bought for my mom. I would kind of go for this wine that got here. That wine is twenty dollars, y'all. Twenty dollars. We got some wine at home, okay? Rosette. All right. So, I'm, how would I make any changes to this? I, I definitely want to go with this idea. And remember, we're supposed to learn to make pasta from scratch. It literally is just two ingredients. I think isn't pasta like just basically egg and flour, but we'll do that on another day, okay? Convenient, little bit of convenience, and it's probably not, ugh, it's frozen. Y'all know how I am about frozen? Y'all know how I am about frozen. But Yolanda don't feel like going home making no fresh tortellini, but, uh, hmm, that's the question. Okay, so, and you know our tomatoes, we get our tomato from the tomatoes on the salad. I definitely want to do the dessert. I definitely want to do the dessert, so... But I'm looking at 325 for some whipped, already whipped. Now, mind you, the convenience factor is here for those of you that have busy families to come and get your apron dish. All right, definitely on the Parmesan, um, I'm going to go with some fresh, I like my fresh, that's that Parmesan and Roman, Romano, Parmesan and Romano uh, mixed in there. But I like this right here, this Parmesan. See, and they have it shredded, they have it shaved, and then they have it all natural. So I would go, look at that. And especially if you're just going to put it on salad. So I would go with something like that. But I like a shave, so we'll get some shaved Parmesan. All right, and that. Let's see. We get the food buzz from the one and only dryer bus. And girl, look, we get the protest buzz for you. Y'all all up in the uh, ERA. ERA. We got to follow that, guys, and see what's going on. Equal, equal rights, right? Because remember I said, I thought it was EPA last time. ERA. Sharon here. Please follow Sharon so that y'all don't have to wait for things to hit the news cycle before you act on it. And one of my phones is like dying. This is Periscope and I can't close it. They Periscope so if y'all cut off, jump over on Facebook. I think that was the second better one. We haven't even made it through the store yet. Okay, so what are we going to get from here? We, we, we already substituted the I'm going to go ahead and get some of this canola oil because I know I don't have oil. And I'm not going to do the almonds. So, literally, here's how we're shopping right here. Publix has made it simple. I'm, I'm definitely going to go ahead and do the tortellini. I think while we're live streaming, that'll fall out nicely. Uh, I'm going to do a salad kit. Bacon Caesar or Caesar? Bacon Caesar, Caesar. Bacon Caesar, Caesar. 
Why not go for the bacon? Bacon, bacon, bacon. See, I'm a ladies out of my buggy so that I can get a nice um, picture on that. And we got the canola oil. We're gonna go upgrade on the Parmesan. See how we're laying out our buggy so we can get our picture. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and 379 on the, I'm gonna get some powdered sugar because we don't have powdered sugar in our repertoire. Um, we already got some honey. Now I noticed they're only doing blueberries, but there are also, oh, there they are, some raspberries. Whoa, we get, we get a choice, y'all, let me think. I'm gonna go with the red. I'm gonna go, am I supposed to get all three? What does it say? I guess we have a choice of the berries. Right? I'm gonna get some blueberries because then I could then we can take the blueberries and we can put the blueberries, some of the blueberries in with our lemonade. So we're gonna do a blueberry as well. Two for five dollars on the blueberry. Do we want to? You gotta always have to think about it when you go to trying to get catch the sale. So we have honey, we need a crust. We're gonna do one of these crusts. See, I don't even have to run all over the store. It's all right here. So I'm gonna do a crust. Uh, I'm not gonna do a tomato. I'm not gonna do an olive. I need a yogurt, cause we're gonna, and the recipe, think about this now. This is a two for $7 on that uh, yogurt. It's the Greek yogurt and it's 24 ounces. The recipe on the yogurt is only calling for one cup. So we're gonna try and make those biscuits. Why wouldn't we make some good biscuits to go with salads? Biscuits are good with salad, right? So we're gonna do the biscuits. Um, the vegetables, where are these vegetables going? Is that just as a side dish? The vegetable mixture, is that just a side dish? Okay, so it's not in the salad. Okay, see, that's what I love. I got a question, she's right there, I can ask her. All right, so I don't necessarily need the vegetable because we're gonna do the salad. And the whip, we're trying to decide on the whip. Let's see on the cream, on the whipped cream, it's calling for one third of a cup. So we'll go ahead and get that. That's not too much of a budget buster, 325. Um, all right, so looking around, making sure we got one of each. We're not gonna do the pork. I'm actually gonna go down here and do some salmon. Uh, we got the powdered sugar. We already got honey. We didn't get the mustard. And I'm debating on the mustard. I know I have some mustard at home, but I'm probably going to run out. It won't hurt to have some Dijon in. Pardon me. <laughs> it wouldn't hurt to have some of that. Tomato, I think I have. I think I have tomato. But I'm going to go to my vegetable store, so I'll get some vegetables there. I won't do the frozen vegetables. I am doing the frozen tortellini. I'm not going to do the pork. I'm going to go and do some fish. I'm going to do a fish with this. And I think that's it. As I look around, I think I have one of each. And we can now move on, all right? I wonder where the honey, honey is going in the dessert. Uh, and we have a dessert cart, which I just dropped here. So there's the buggy in case anybody drops off. So we've got our buggy items. All right, so now we need to do is figure out how we're gonna substitute meat. Let me see what, let me just double check this um, Parmesan and make sure. I'm gonna need one fourth cup plus one tablespoon of grated Parmesan. And it looks like there is some just basically on the salad. But I wanna do, because of the salad I won't have a taste for, I'm gonna do shaved. Honey, Dijon, mustard, canola oil, powdered sugar, kosher salt, we have salt. Um, so let's go back in and check out what the butcher has. And I'll put that there as our recipes. You can see Buggy Cam loves seafood, loves public seafood. I know, I'll go there for the, I'm gonna go back here and see what you can find on the salmon. I really got a taste for some salmon. And I think this is perfect with salmon. And one reason I wanna use salmon because we have a new spice from Dr. Flavor Spices. And I think the salmon is going to do us great justice. So, oh, I'm trying to think. Because I'm looking over here, I'm seeing a bunch of sale items over there. I'm like, mm, I might want to, I 
might want to rethink the salmon because the salmon is so expensive. Okay. It's running eight seventy nine. Trying to think who all I'm cooking for. Stella Rosa. I, I got some. I think I still have some wine. Um, um, let's think. What do I want? I'm looking at the fish here, guys. I'm trying to think do I. What did I say I needed from? And I'm, I think I'm going to lose Periscope because I didn't bring the charger in with me. So I'm not plugged up. And there's too much open because it's killing the battery. Uh, huh. Okay. Is this stuff pretty spicy? That cake? It's not that spicy. It's the huh? If you want to splurge, you want to splurge on some salmon. Let's splurge on some salmon. I want some good salmon. Covered on the outside. Uh -huh. I think I do. Hey there. I guess three. I don't get think. some, right? Um, I'm looking to decide between the rainbow trail or the cafe. Mm. I like trail. Yeah, I like trail. Salmon does look good, right? Like, like rainbow trail? That's what my kids like. Yeah, they had a cracker barrel, but I've never cooked it before. I go fishing line. I eat it, me and my wife. I I yeah, I want to get some salmon. Um, trying to think if I, how much I want. I got to do three people. How many people? Yeah. If I want to need like three good fillets. That depends on the size. I know. I'm thinking about these two down front or either that long piece there. Three people, those two. But if you want a bigger one. I'm trying to think, do I want to cook it all at one time? That looks good what you got in your hand. Let me get that. Because I forget, we're doing salad, so I don't need, I don't need a lot. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put it on a salad, so that should, that should work. Anything else for you? I think that's going to be it. One person's going to turn their nose up at it anyway. So. <laughs> like, really? <laughs> $7.99. Oh, I can't do shrimp. Wish I could. Oh, okay. Wish I could. All right. Okay, so yeah, we're going to do salmon. So there's our buddy. And that's pretty much it, guys. So I'm going um, to knock off Periscope, guys, because your battery's dying on your device. So thank you. All right. All right, Facebook. Let's see what else we need. Periscope. Okay. I'm doing a dual broadcast, guys. Um, but let's see. I don't think I, I don't think I need anything else. Oh, let's go get us some herbs. We don't have. I cannot do salmon without some dill. And you know what? I've got. I'm wondering if that's a. Um, this new ingredient we've got, new spice we got from Dr. Flavor Spices. And I got butter. I better get some butter because I never have enough butter. And don't forget, we're going to do the biscuit. So we're going to need some butter for that. Okay. Um, we're going to try this biscuit. Greek. It's just basically Greek yogurt and flour. You just fold this in flour. Makes a great dough. I'm, of course, listening to Patty Betty telling me to do it. And I have cream because I'm thinking about something with some cream. Um, I need some buttermilk just in case. I don't have buttermilk in I gotta have buttermilk in I don't know if it's I'm old now, but I just feel like I gotta <laughs> gotta keep buttermilk on hand. I don't drink it, but I have found that when I want something sweet and I take the buttermilk, look, butter and buttermilk, it's like y'all help me. I got eggs. Um but buttermilk and flour, a little sugar, um, chocolate pancakes, chocolate pancakes, you know, a fourth of a cup of flour, a fourth of a cup of sugar, a fourth of a cup of a half, a, no, an eighth of a cup of um, um, cocoa, and oh my God, a little bit of cream, and that makes a really good chocolate pancake. Okay, 
I'm not doing, I'm looking at these mushrooms over here calling my name. Oh, some fried mushrooms on the salad would be good. Hmm, wait, let me think. I'm doing too much. Got to get back and want to cook. That's the thing about the shopping. You got to get back and want to cook. Um, I'm trying to think. I don't think I have any fresh time. Okay, time and deal. I'm not going to do rosemary. You know, remember last time I said I was missing that rosemary after I didn't do the rosemary? All right, so we're going to do a little bit of time and deal on that. I'm going to marinate that uh, salmon with, and actually... We don't. We won't even have time to marinate because we gotta gotta cook. But I'm thinking some mushroom just to kind of spice up the um, salad kit because we're doing the tortellini on there. Just like a, is it a sauce or a dressing that's on this thing? Wait a minute. Let me see. Oh, I guess it's gonna. It's probably gonna make a dressing with the with the um, mustard. Let's see. What's on the something's on this? Oh, the Caesar dressing is on the salad. But well, what is the mustard going? Let's figure out where the mustard is going. It combined salad bowl. Yep. Parmesan. Wait a minute. Combined in salad bowl. Parmesan. Cream cheese. Mustard. Caesar dressing. Reserve. Pasta water. Oh. Whisker too smooth. Drain off. Hmm. Wait a minute here. Combine in a salad bowl. One fourth cup Parmesan cheese. So that's why I wanted the other cheese. Cream cheese and the mustard. What cream cheese? Whipped cream cheese or salad. I thought the cream cheese was going in with the dessert. The berry tart is just the Greek yogurt. That's interesting. The cream cheese is going, I thought the cream cheese was going in with the dessert. But the cream cheese is going into the salad dressing. That's interesting. The tomato is going, okay, so for the salad, you got your Tomato, the salad kits, your meat, your salt, pepper, canola oil, the cheese tortellini, the grated Parmesan cheese, the whipped cream cheese, or sour cream. So I have an option to go. I'm interested to try that whipped cream cheese. Dijon mustard and the olives. We don't care too much about olives. Um, but the tart is really only the... Greek yogurt. Where is the honey going? The honey's just dribbling on there. Stir honey into the yogurt until blended. Spread half a cup of yogurt over the pie crust. Place one half of the berries in a single layer. Repeat both layers. Mm. Sprinkle with the sugar chill until ready. So the, I thought the cream cheese was going in with the... We gonna put the cream cheese in there because I want some cream cheese in there. Okay, so the cream cheese is basically doing two things. Uh, okay, guys, I think we're ready to go because I'm, I'm up leveling too much here. And we got the budget, so we got to think about the budget. And I, I got to go to my other store because I need some more lemon. Because Patty Batty decided finally to taste the lemonade because she thought that I put the pieces in there. And now I got to go and start all over and make the stomach. I Teddy Betty had the nerve to come and tell me I need a bigger pitcher for the lemonade. I wasn't making it for you. So now we have to make some more. We don't even we can't even dilute it because too many people are drinking it. So we have to go and do that. Alright, I think we and, and we're gonna make a biscuit. So the tortellini can kind of thaw out while we are fooling with the biscuit. Because we got enough, we got enough yogurt to do a couple of things. All right, let's find us a spot in line. And I gotta get some pictures of the buggy. And uh, I guess I will catch you guys back in the kitchen. All right, so y'all have a good day.